<laughs> All right, guys. Uh, so now we're back to do the third technique of lesson plan number three, module number five. Coach and I have switched just because these next two um, options involve a double knee set on top of the tummy, and I just feel bad about doing that to Coach. So I would rather her do that to me, but I'm gonna walk you through this. So Coach is gonna do the same thing. She's taking her reverse grip, she's got her balance, she brings this in, she's gonna elongate, she closes everything off, and she's in control right now, right? So now she's gonna go ahead and go ahead and come up, right? So she's coming up, she drives this knee all the way across, right? She's doing great here. But now we've got to get to the mounted position. There's going to be two primary things that happen. As you watch this video, you'll be able to see what my feet do. But the better you get, you're going to have to rely on the feel. That being said, that comes after a lot of repetition. So if you can't quite feel it after a month of playing with this, that's okay. Most people don't feel it for years, right? So check this out. Coach now is going to take me in this direction and her knees go onto my stomach. Now look at my feet. My feet are together. Because my feet are together, Coach can use her outside leg to push, to gain space, and now she's in a mounted position. So she's great, right? So we'll look at that one more time. And again, this option has my feet crossed like so. Let's watch it from the beginning. Coach again is here. I have a knee shield on. She starts to clear everything. Boom. Yep. Excellent. Now she's set. I'm squeezing her leg. She's going to elevate a little bit. Three quarter mount, excellent. Now, watch as she moves over and puts her knees on my stomach. Boom, right here. Because my feet are together like this, when she pushes with this outside leg, she gets her movement. And because she gets movement, she's able to secure the position. Now, as we move into the next technique, you're gonna see my foot position a little bit different. And it's imperative, like I said, that you notice it right now visually. Just know that later on, you will be able to feel the difference, right? Um, and the piece where coach's knees were on my tummy, it's super important that you actually do that piece. I know sometimes you feel bad about doing it to your teammate, kind of like I felt bad about doing it to coach, which is why I had her do it, but you do need to learn the process. All right, guys, see you on the next technique.